Hello guys, it's God Assassin here. I'm back and I got back into the groove. I worked really hard. I was a level 48, 6th generation the last time I played this game about a month ago. I took a very long break. I was very sick. So I apologize for the late lack of content on my channel that will be changing this upcoming week. Uh, Tuesday, Watch Dogs comes out, so I might do like a an hour video just to see how it goes, and if you guys like it, I will do it. But anyway, back to the task at hand. As you can see, I am 7th generation, level 5. It took a long time to get it there. I did a video on all the challenges in 6th gen. If you guys missed them, it's in the plays and down in my channel. It's the Titanfall. You'll find all my gameplays, all my stats, and anything you miss of Titanfall related in that playlist. So let's just get right into it. We'll go right into personal stats first. We'll do the overview. I found out that the using six gen for the triple threat, I found that a lot easier to get kills, so I recommend that. The carbine's still my favorite thing. Uh, attrition's still my number one gameplay. All my challenges, all my all the all the stuff I have unlocked is there. 78% win percentage, which is an excellent 203 out of the 452 games I played. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Kill records, I think they're a little bit lower than the last generation. Just because now I'm focusing just on uh, challenges. So they're now they're, it's going to go lower. I'm assuming it's going to get lower because these challenges are really starting to get really bugging me. So that's why I'm not planning on really going try hard in Titanfall anymore until I get a group, get a group of people and then I'll go try hard on my challenges again. As you can see, I was still a 2.2. I'm still above a 2.1, just like my goal was intended to be in a 4.7 in lifetime average against people and bots. Now, for the time I played, I don't think it's changed much. It's still two days, 21 hours. It's almost three days. If I focus hard enough in this game, I will make it to three days. I just don't know when. Uh, probably, hopefully this weekend, if I grip some time and get my level up, I might make it to three days. But like I said, I've been really sick lately. and <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm still sick. But I am feeling a whole lot better, so now I'm going back into the gaming world again. I am starting to focus more on uh, multiplayer games. I just, I've been super sick. I've, I really just haven't had the time. There is no loadouts yet. I'm still level five, so there really is nothing to show you in that section. But I am going to show you seven generations challenges and regen requirements. Freshly squeezed. You can see here is get one execution kill as a strider, which I am told instead of I think it's 50, which what you have to do with the tie in and the strider tie in. You gotta when they're in doomed, you gotta melee them and then execute them by squeezing them. I think you gotta do that about 50 times. Then there's if it moves an entire titan killer with the chain gun. I'm, a, I'm pretty much pretty damn good with the chain gun now just because of that fifth generation bullshit I don't need to go into details you want to see that video it's in the, it's in that playlist go to the fifth generation I promise that you will be surprised how hard it is um, the g 2 a4 rifle if it moves and top gun I think those are gonna be pretty easy I like those those single shot guns anyway so I don't think those are gonna be easy. The charge rifle, I think you need 20 Titan, ki Titan kills with the charge rifle, which I don't think it's going to be too hard. But like I said, there always has to be that one challenge that's going to take you forever, and that's going to be freshly squeezed for 7th generation. Now, for people who've seen my 5th generation video, you know how much I hated 5th generation. But I'm glad to tell you that it has the Goozer challenge has been fixed. You'll no longer have to get 50 ejecting pilot kills. You only need 5. So, good for you guys. If you're still leveling up and you're wondering, why is 5th gen going to be so hard? Calm it down. It's a lot easier now for you guys. They updated it in the latest update of Titanfall. I, um, I'm glad I got the challenge done before it did because that's the only thing they really changed in challenges. So I was really proud of myself for doing it. So that shows how well I actually work hard for my stuff. So 
Anyway guys, that's all I really have time for for the stats update. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like down below and comment and let me know what your KDs, what classes you use, what your favorite maps, and all sorts of things. Let me know down below what you guys think of my stats and tell me your stats. I like I like to know if you guys are higher than me, what levels you are. I'd like to know. So leave a comment down below and let me know guys. And as always guys, I'm Brad Assassin and I'll see you guys in the next stats update.